Andre Semenna, Stephen Kwan, when you've got guys like that behind you as a pitching staff, you feel awfully good about putting the ball over the plate because guys like these can take hits away. Those guys have the hardware to show it. Andres gets not only the gold glove, but the platinum glove as well. And Stephen Kwan, another gold glove to add to his collection. Tristan McKenzie will be the starting pitcher for the Guardians. He'll be making his third start of the young campaign. Has struck out four, but walked six. Now the 3-2 pitch. And it's ball four. He missed low and away. And once again, a Yankee gets a walk. You got to limit the walks. You, you just can't continue to give these guys free base runners. Had six free passes in game one. Now the 3 2 pitch. Inside, he's walked the first two Yankees. And now you face Aaron Judge. Double play ball. Arias goes to second for one. Jimenez had trouble. And he didn't get them out anywhere. Jimenez came off the bag at second and didn't have control of the baseball and then the throw to first they didn't get him there either. Oh my goodness. You talk about setting up an inning. Yeah he came up off the bag but did he land on that bag. Guess not. And then the short hop wow. and Naylor can't pick it. Holy smokes. Here's Anthony Rizzo bases loaded nobody out. Line drive right back up the middle. That's going to be a base hit as Volpe is going to score easily. And Anthony Rizzo continuing his hot hitting from game one. Base hit and RBI, and the Yankees are on the board. Nice job by Rizzo going down to get it and just basically serving it into center field. This first inning couldn't start any worse. My wow. goodness. This is one. about as ugly an inning as you yeah, can see. I mean, Three 20, walks and error. 24 Bases pitches. Still loaded. Nobody out, balls. and it's 2 0 New York. Now the 0 2. Curveball swung on, popped him up behind the plate. Fry has a play. Foul territory. The catcher makes the catch. That's out number one. Swung on, double play ball to second. Glove by Jimenez to second one. Rocchio turns it. Boy, they had to have that. Give McKenzie credit. He didn't help himself with three walks, but he didn't let the game get away. Yankees with two. Cleveland coming to bat. Yankee right hander Cody Petit making his first start for the Yankees. And Petit's 2 0. Swung on, fisted in the air to center field. Right there is Judge, makes the grab for the first out. First pitch swinging, lazy fly ball to left field. Easy play for Verdugo, two down. The 3 1. Swinging a hard ground ball to second base, waiting for it is Torres. He gloves on the outfield grass and throws to first, and it's in time. And a quick 1 2 3 inning, and Cody Poteet's return to a major league mound here in the first. 2 0 Yanks, two down, nobody on. Second inning, top of the order again, Anthony Volpe. Drilled deep right center and a near collision. Florio held on to the ball as he and Laureano did collide, and it's great to see them both up. I think they're okay. So a one, two, three inning, but it got a little eventful when Florio, the right fielder, made a terrific running catch on the track in deep right center. Two down, nobody on. Esteban Florio will hit here in the bottom of the second. And the one, two, swung on and missed. Strike three. Cody Poteet, six up, six down. Yankees up two nothing, two down here in the third. Anthony Rizzo will hit. Swung on, hard ground ball through the hole into right field. It's another base hit for Rizzo as he is two for two. Two singles in as many at-bats for the Yankees cleanup hitter. Here's the right-handed hitting DH, Giancarlo Stanton. Reaches out, sends a routine fly to center, and Laureano puts it away. So Tristan McKenzie has really come back strong. 30 pitches in the first and 23 total pitches in the next two innings combined. David Fry leads off for Cleveland here in the bottom of the third. Fry sends one on a line to straightaway center, base hit. So David Fry, the first Cleveland Guardian to get on base. And it's on the outside oh corner my. called strike three a four seamer from Poteet at 94 Arias is frozen second strikeout for Poteet we're underway in the fourth inning Tristan McKenzie goes back to work here's McKenzie's 3 0 delivery fastball just downstairs for ball four here's the three two down low ball four that's the fifth walk and the second time he's walked the first two batters in an inning first and third two down in the inning but now back to the top of the lineup for Anthony Volpe line drive back up the middle base hit Torres will score easily three nothing Yankees and a nice piece of two out hitting from Anthony Volpe well that's probably why you haven't seen too many fastballs from McKenzie I mean he's not going to last throwing 90 miles an hour because you can't be perfect I think he's doing very well to get through this and only have given up a couple of runs he's not through yet with Juan Soto at the plate two on two outs 
Swing and a blast. Center field and deep. Laureano going back on the warning track. At the wall, he looks up. It is gone. A home run. Juan Soto. Swinging on 3-0. Soto delivers a blast to straightaway center field. A three-run shot. Home run number three. And the Yankees are in front. They double their lead. They're up 6-0. Well, this is what happens when you get in the middle of the lineup and you start giving up the walks. The walk to Torres scored. Verdugo scored. You get behind. 3-0. Flash another 89-mile-an-hour four-seamer from McKenzie. Here's the 3-0 delivery. Up high, ball four, and he walked him on four straight. And it is so, so tough to win when you walk batters, and that's number six for McKenzie. Here comes the 3 2 pitch. Called strike three. There's one on the outside corner, and the side is retired, but the Yankees put up four in the fourth. Tyler Beatty has come on to pitch for the Guardians here in the fifth inning. Tristan McKenzie's evening is done. Yankees continuing to create traffic on the base pad. One of the hottest Yankee hitters finds himself in another RBI opportunity here in the fifth. Hot shot over the head of Naylor. That's going to be extra base as Glaber Torres scores easily. Verdugo to third. Oswaldo Cabrera with an RBI double and the hot hitting from the Yankees third baseman continues second and third and still just one out. Here's the number nine hitter Austin Wells the catcher. Wells gets under this one drills at the center field and deep Loriano right in front of the warning track. That's going to be a sacrifice fly and an RBI for Wells eight nothing Yankees. Two more runs on the board for New York. We are headed to the bottom of the fifth. Esteban Florial steps in. There you go. Loreal gets into one at deep right field. Soto's back. He's out of room. It's out of here. Esteban Florial's first home run in the Guardians uniform gets Cleveland on the board. And I'm going to guess that feels awfully good for that young man after spending his entire pro career in the Yankees organization until this year. Eight to one New York. Guardians have runners at first and third with two down. Number five hitter Ramon Laureano. There's action in that Yankee bullpen. You got to believe that Petit kind of smelling the finish line now. Swing and a miss, and Laureano's down on strikes, and Poteet, he might be done for the night as he gets through six innings. Last to the eighth, 8-1 eight, Yankees on the 1-2. Swing and a fly ball down the left field line, moving toward the line and sliding and making the grab is Alex Verdugo. Outstanding range for Alex Verdugo going a long way to his right to make that play. That ball is tailing away from him as well. Catches it, little slide. We go now to the bottom of the ninth. One down, and that'll bring up Josh Naylor, one for three. And he drives one to deep right, down the line. There she goes, a solo shot. And it's eight to two. Yankees still in command, but Josh Naylor with his fourth home run tops on the ball club and that was a laser down the right field line. Estevan Florial the last hope for the Guardians here and the one two fly ball to center field Grisham on ball game over the Yankees are 12 and three they've won the first five series to begin the season that is the third time in franchise history a long day of baseball but a happy day for Aaron Boone as his club takes two games.